dope that is. Dope that is. Dope that is. Dope. Look down. You're talking to your highness. Can't see me. I'm the reason for your blindness. They try this, but I'm too classy for your lines. Got my double cups up. That's the reason that I'm like this. Like this. Like this. Welcome to episode two of Dupe There It Is, which should be actually episode one because this is an actual amazing dupe, not a knockoff. Uh, if you are new to my channel, hello, I am Blaze, I am Wicked, I hope you are too, and if you are, please go down, hit that subscribe button, because I always have at least one free monthly beauty giveaway, 100% free, no catch, not sponsored, it goes from my pocket, gives directly to you. If you are aware, this is a budget beauty and budget living and bargain shopping channel. So we budget shop for everything because we can't afford expensive stuff because we've got bills to pay and what else do we need? You know, like toilet paper and stuff. I did a different kind of look with my eyes today. Please let me know your honest opinion down below if I should attempt to do more looks like this or just stay where I'm comfortable. <laughs> so the dupes we are going to be trying out today are from probably my new favorite makeup brand. And damn it, it is not sold in stores that I I don't believe it is. Um, I think it's exclusively online. You can get it at Hush, uh, shophush.com. Uh, but we got these on eBay. These were actually Valentine's gifts from my mother. So it comes with a pack of six. So these are the the, it would be good if I knew the name of them. The Oakalyn Vivid Matte Liquid Lipsticks. Yes, yes, yes. And of course, you can even just tell by the packaging, they are dupes for the Lime Crime Velveteen Lippies. So yes, both have roses, different brands. So I was so excited that my uh, subscriber grandma, uh, she sent me this in my latest huge P.O. box opening and I was like, awesome. So I actually have the dupe and the actual product the dupe is for with you so you can see the differences or the similarities, you know. I am of course going to be lip swatching these. Um, so pray for my lips. So let's, before we get into all that, look at the Lime Crime Velveteen Lipstick. The shade I was sent is in, yes, the shade I was sent was in the shade Beat It. And this is the packaging. If you've never seen Lime Crime Velveteen Lipsticks, it's got a red top with roses and Lime Crime written on it. And it's in this like frosted glass tube. And it's got the name on the bottom. So, this is the color. It's like a very dark wine berry kind of color right there. Very, very, very gorgeous color. Let's see if does this have any scent. Oh yeah, that smells kind of like, it smells like paint and vanilla, vanilla paint. That, ooh, can that be a thing? I already have diabetes. So let's take one of the Oakalyn Vivid Matte Lipsticks just to compare and then we'll do some hand swatches and then I will do lip swatches so you can see what these look like. So to compare the Lime Crime and the Oakalyn, this is the Oakalyn one. Same red top but this one has little kiss marks on it instead of roses. Still has that frosted glass and the name of the shade down there. Oh. So these are what the two look like together. So you can see it is a 100% authentic dupe. This is an authentic brand. This is not like a cheap knockoff brand that you just, you know, that's made in China. This is like a legit brand and I am in love with it. So yes, so let's watch this one. This one is in the shade Santa Fe. I love this color on me. I think that it is a beautiful, nice, light, pinky nude color. Look at that. It is so beautiful. These do not dry down. Just letting you know they have a matte finish and they're very pigmented and opaque. I tried this one and I didn't try the other one. So I can say only for this one, but 
So that's what the two are. That's the Lime Crime and that's Oakalin. So that's the first one. Then we have this shade in Mil Millbrook? Millbrook. So it is this shade right here. And oh, this is gonna be my favorite shade. I, I can already tell. It is like a grayish purple. So, so pretty. I am so bad at swatching. I'm sorry guys, um, I'm not a professional swatcher. Um, so this one is in the uh, shade Clairvoyant. Ooh, since I am Clairvoyant, that intrigues me. It is a very dark, dark plum looking color, like vampy. Yes, I'm here for that. So whenever you feel like a vampire, this one is a little bit more, um, not as opaque, but you may have to just put an extra coat on and you'll be good. I don't know, we'll see. Then we have this one in Turkish Rose. And it is this pretty color right here, which looks kind of like a dusty rose nude. Yeah, that's really pretty. Really, really pretty. I'm loving these colors so far. Uh, then we have the shade Oriental Pink. Ooh, that's a nice bright pastel-y kind of, not pastel, but like, yeah, I guess you could say like a very light baby pastel pink. Very nice. And the last shade we have here is Aubergine or Aubergine or Aubergine. I've heard it pronounced so many different things. So it is going to be an Aubergine kind of color. Uh, very similar to the other one, except this one's more like a brownish purple. And this one is definitely more opaque than the other one. So again, the first swatch down here is the Lime Crime, and all of these are the Oakland ones that I will be lip swatching. I'm also going to lip swatch the um, Lime Crime Velveteen just to show you a comparison. So let's pray for my lips and let's get to a lip swatch pit. Yes! Yeah, yeah. Nice. So I just kept the last one, Aubergine, on my lips. Uh, so I love these. These were all the lip swatches from the set from Oakland. Their liquid vivid matte lip stick, liquid lipstick. Guys, seriously, I haven't slept in days. <laughs> my final review 
um the darker ones the two darker ones did go on a little bit not streaky but like a little streaky and sheer and patchy a little bit nothing like a, it's a travesty you know uh if you do one and a half two coats you're good um i didn't like the way that uh what color was it i think it was oriental pink yes oriental pink uh also you'll need two coats because it did go on kind of streaky I don't think I don't know I don't know if it's my kind of color but it's still pretty uh, my favorite color you guys will have seen is Millbrook I love gray purple mauves oh I love them uh, Turkish rose was gorgeous I mean these are awesome awesome dupes for the lime crime and I think I paid $15.99 for all of these and for, I believe, for, for one Lime Crime Velveteen, it is $20, just for one, at least $20. Um, I will definitely put that information in this video just to not make an ass out of myself. But yeah, so you get all these, which I kind of feel are like the same formula, except the Velveteen does dry down like... I want to say 90%, maybe 85%. These do not dry down, but they are so, so comfortable on the lips. They're shiny. I love, they're, they feel nourishing, like moisturizing. They're not uncomfortable. It doesn't feel like you've got tons and tons of lip product on. I absolutely love these, and I will be giving these five Wicked Little Devils. These are Blaze approved. I will link down below where these where you can find these um if you want to go ahead and check them out for yourselves i definitely would i adore Oakalyn and i adore these lipsticks and i'm definitely going to be you hear listen how it's like cheers oh no that wasn't the right sound let's get it cheers I don't know, I don't drink. Anyway, I hope this video was informative or entertaining and or helpful in any way. Um, if you do like my dupe, there it is, video series, please give me a big ol' thumbs up to let me know. <laughs> Good morning, starshine. The earth says hello. I uh, just filmed my collective beauty haul. Um, video where I did show the other Oakland products that I have and in that video I will link it in this video somewhere or down below I'm not sure uh, but it will be in this video where you can go and check that out uh, there is a poll going on for which eyeshadow palette you guys would like to see uh, first on dupe there it is I'm going to be doing both of them but I just want your opinion which one you're interested in seeing first so uh, definitely go check that video out and take the poll vote let your voice be heard my wicked one all right i gotta go thank you guys so so much for watching this video and for staying with me and giving me some time to recover and being so patient and sweet and awesome people i love you guys to the moon and back and until next time stay wicked <gasps> you can count on me to miss babe a donna girl fill the void up with that